Okay, we're in Microsoft Excel and we want to sum up based on a date range. I'm going to use a function called SUMIFS. Make sure you choose the plural version, SUMIFS, not SUMIF. And the first argument is sum range, so that's what you want to add up. So for me, that's quantity, comma, and then we have criteria range one. So which is the range you're going to apply the first criteria to? Well, both of my criteria are based on the same column, the date column. So I'm going to select that, comma, and then criteria one. So what criteria do we want to apply to this first range? Well, it's got to be greater than or equal to my start date. So in quotation marks, you write greater than or equal to, close quotation marks, and then ampersand. Now ampersand will join that comparison operator to our start date, comma. So then we're onto criteria range two. Now our second criteria is going to be this end date. So that also applies to the date column, which I will select. And the criteria for that will be less than or equal to this end date. So less than or equal to, and then ampersand the end date. Again, this ampersand symbol joins this cell reference to this comparison operator. So then all I need to do is close the bracket, press enter, and I will get the correct answer. The only other thing worth telling you is what you do if you want to hard code the dates into your formula. So by that, I mean, you haven't got the dates on your spreadsheet, you want the dates to exist within the formula. Now, what you have to do is you start with a speech mark, then your comparison operator, and then you literally write the date in. Now, these dates are in UK format, day, month, and year, but you can write in the dates in whatever format that you're used to using, as long as it's recognized by Excel. And then this would be the same. We would say less than or equal to, and then enter our end date. And you just put that little speech mark at the end, press enter, and it will still work. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next video.